Okay, I'm here with Patty and Energe Energetically in Harmony is, is the name of the company. And this is a fantastic collection of uh, stones you have here. Can you tell us something about it? So, as we, um, our bodies are energy, okay? And in that, along with our bodies, the stones are energy, the table, the floor, everything around this is energy. And so there was a point in time where we first walked the earth that we were connected, very connected with the earth. And since then, with technology, we've gone away from that. And we're now so busy and so fast-paced that we're not as connected as we used to be. So the stones help us connect with that. Um, as you know, in radios and computers, we have ports, right? which are programmable, which the crystals are also programmable. And so, it's, to varying degrees, you know, some folks come in here and they're, as you did with the stones, which stone is good for sadness, let's say. Okay. But it's not about that. It's about being in connection with your intuitive self and understanding to listen to that message. So, back to the beginning where we used to not have technology and we used to be connected with the earth. We would pay attention to the messages we would receive. We would be able to talk to each other without speaking. Okay? But we've since migrated towards that because again of technology and how we evolve. So we no longer listen to what that message is. Right? And the crystals help us do that. The crystal helps us get back what I call is center. Okay? I teach my students how to get in center. So when you're going down the road, a one one lane road let's say, you want to stay in the center in order to keep us safe, right? Every once in a while, let's say maybe we had uh, alcohol, and, and that, that puts us under an influence, right? Then we get off center. What happens when we get off center? We'll run into something. We'll cause our soul to harm, okay? So what I teach a lot of my students about being in center, okay? You have the best day ever, right? And you feel on top of the world, nothing can shake you. You're in center, right? You're driving down the street and there's a lot of traffic and someone cuts you off. So what? You're on top of the world. You're in center, nothing can shake you. You go to work, you have a hard day. You're still having a good day, nothing can shake you. That night you go home and you don't sleep that well and you get a phone call from your mother and she's upset. And so you wake up the next morning and you're no longer quite in center and you're not really practicing the meditation or the energy work. So you stay off the path. Maybe you're this far off the path now, right? Somebody cuts you off then and you're not in center anymore and you're not practicing the energy work. So you're still here instead of being in center. So that kind of upsets you and you're further off the track. Okay. You go to work, and it's the same stressful day you had yesterday, but you're here instead of here. So now it shakes you even further because you're not practicing the energy work, right? And then before you know it, you start deteriorating your auric field, which basically extends out if you were to extend your hands out. And if you were to take your arms and put them on top of your head and your feet, it extends that far out, okay, typically. Once you start getting off of center and once you start not getting enough sleep or you're not eating right for exercise, that contributes to you being off center and not being on your game, so to speak. And that starts affecting you. Okay? And so lots of times, over time, if you stay off of that center, it can cause disease. Okay? And if continually, it could cause something serious. Okay? So what the crystals will do is it'll help you. Also, it's a reminder to what you need to pay attention to in your body. Now, not all crystals will be for every day because we change. Our days change. What we need changes. So, when the same principle of not feeling well and we reach for orange juice or we take extra vitamin C. We're not doing that every day. But we know when to do it. So it's about paying attention to your body. So once again, being in center is about listening to your body. And if more of us could listen to our body, we'd be a whole lot healthier. Okay, so it's what a lot of us don't listen to. So basically, in a nutshell, the crystals help to keep us energetically in So if we needed to get crystals from you, where would we contact you? Uh, you can contact me on the web. Uh, you can contact me.
send me an email, uh, energeticallyinharmony at gmail.com, or you can go to energeticallyinharmony.com, or you can call me directly. What I like to do with a lot of my students uh, and people that want to purchase crystals, I like to do the meditation work uh, over the phone and long distance because people are comfortable in that space. And then once I connect with them, they tell me what kind of crystals they want, and then I'll go through my inventory because I am, once again, energetically connected with them, and I'll go and pick out what they need. Give her a call. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so that crystal right there is the Strawberry Lemurian. She does the healing work with me. Her name is Jeannie, along with the Moonstone Spirit back there. They both do the healing work.